Jumbo, my name is Florence. So I'm a tour leader and I do trips through uh, Kenya and Tanzania. My favorite part of the trip is Serengeti. Yes, when we get to stay in a, a campsite that is not fenced, you hear animals walking around the campsite and sometimes they come so close. Yeah, it's a good experience. What I love most about Kenya, number one is the people of Kenya. They are very friendly, they give you information and they are very just happy people. Also, we have uh, the wildlife. People come all the way to come and see our wildlife, so it makes me proud of my country. Yeah. So, you know, extinct doesn't necessarily mean it's gone, but the number is not sustainable. Yeah. So, chances are it might not be brought back to its numbers. So, you're lucky to see this. Sometimes passengers come with a lot of expectation, high expectations, especially when it comes to the wildlife they expect to see. You know, they watch all these documentaries and they want to see exactly that. You want to meet all those expectations, but sometimes it's hard. You know, you can't drive on a game drive and expect to meet a lion. It's just what nature has to offer. Every time we have a stop, we buy fresh food from the villages, from the markets. Some people come here and they think, oh, okay, we eat zebra meat, we eat all this wild stuff. But along the trip, they go like, oh, I didn't expect this. <laughs> so good, yeah, it tastes good, the food is really good. Chop, chopping, chopping, chopping. There's a trend that is coming up about people coming with just mobile phones to take pictures of animals. I think people believe that the phones nowadays are taking good pictures, but I think they take good pictures when it's a bit close. I would advise passengers to travel with good cameras, zooms, or the two, because if you're taking pictures of, uh, let's say, people, then the phone is good, because then it doesn't look intimidating. I love my job. It's uh, really good to meet with people from different cultures and um, just showing off my country, being proud of what we have as a continent in Africa.